morning. It's Thursday, it is winter. So today we are going off to meet two of our friends, Esol and Charlotte. Esol is the baby, Charlotte is the mummy. And they're probably gonna be watching this video. They're probably waiting downstairs, so sorry that I'm running a bit late. But I have this little bundle of joy who is in her ergo baby. It doesn't seem to be happy, so I've had to walk around, camera down, and we're getting there, but we're heading out the door. We're going to a mummy and baby group at the local church, which is the first time we've gone to something like this. So we're having quite a social mummy and baby week. I guess that is what the start of parenthood is like. Coffee and cake and singing songs. Just to give you an idea of what we look like, I do look like a pulled together hipster mum with her handbag, looking really cool. But this is only because Ingmar went to work this morning with the wheels for the buggy and obviously the car seat, and the change bag. So I've had to kind of make a change bag in my handbag. But we are running late, so <clears throat> I'm losing my voice. We better go. made Mia a little throne on the sofa with the breastfeeding pillow and she seems to love it. We're just hanging out here with Monkey, playing away. It's great fun, she loves it. Yes, you want to give them kisses, but really you want to just eat them. <coughs> yummy, yummy. <coughs> Mwah. Mwah. I love you, Mia. Mwah. 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 <laughs> I've been editing um, her christening video, which was filmed many, many, many weeks ago now. And so watching the difference between you now and you in that video is crazy to see the difference. I feel like it's a bit of a card shop in here with so many cards. We are very, very lucky to have so many cards sent to us from people. Um, but yes, I was gonna say it, the group today was really, really nice. So it was kind of a play group. Um, and there, there weren't that many children there, maybe about five, I think we were like the sixth person. Um, and we had toys out on the floor and then they had songs by the piano and someone actually p played a piano. And we did songs in English and Icelandic, so mommy needs to get learning some of those lyrics, yes. Um, but yeah, it was really, really fun and I got a cup of coffee <laughs> to keep me warm because it was pretty cold walking there. But we did the, the carrier and it was fine. We were cosy, I had my hot water bottle and you had all your snuggly layers on, yes. And then we came back here with Esol and Charlotte and mummy, the mummies had pizza and salad. And then now we're just chilling and waiting for daddy to come home with all the food from shopping so that I can make dinner for us. We just go from one meal to the next. Yes, we do. You go from one meal to the next, with naps in between. Yes, naps are important. So this isn't a strip for her. Uh, this is actually for her cousin Aidan for his first birthday. But I just thought I'm going to try it on her and see what she looks like because she doesn't have one yet. So yeah, there we go, Mia. Your first Icelandic football top. Yeah, you love it. <laughs> Yay! It is cold. Winter! Yeah, it's four degrees. And look at how much dust there is on the car. Oh, we made it to Friday. What a morning it has been. It pretty much started about three o'clock in the morning with this little lady not wanting to go to sleep or go back to sleep. She was basically, she had a feed. She had two feeds, really. I tried, I really tried. Tried singing her to sleep, tried rocking her to sleep, walking her to sleep. Nope, she was having none of it. Um, and then by about quarter past four, I was just in agony. Um, my shoulder, my left shoulder has been really, really sore for the last couple of days and my right shoulder just froze up. It was cramping, I couldn't lift her. I had to wake Ingmar, get him to pick her up for me. 
Um, then he gave me a massage and then got the hot water bottle on it so I could actually lie back down. <laughs> he looked after me up, bless him, all morning until 11 o'clock. So he managed to take some time off work. And I just got some painkillers into me and tried to sleep and then got up and had a hot shower and I'm kind of mobile now. It is sore. <laughs> I'm just sore all over. I feel like I'm breaking. Um, yeah, so we're now out and about. I'm trying to basically distract myself. Someone's walked walk past me and they're looking at me like I'm a proper weirdo. Um, <laughs> so yeah, I'm distracting myself by meeting up with a couple of friends. Well, one friend and one possibly new friend. That's a bit weird to say. Um, other mummies and babies for lunch. So I've driven over to Hafnafjordur, which is another area um, of, is it a part of Reykjavik? I think it's a different district to Reykjavik. So I haven't really been here before. It's really cute, um, but I'm already lost. Yeah, so Google Maps has told me I have arrived, but it doesn't, none of these buildings look like the picture. So I'm gonna have to have a little wonder with Mia to try and find them. <laughs> this week has been a social week of coffee, cakes and lunch. <laughs> that is mum life I suppose. Yeah and so are bits. Mummy is quite happy in her chair, loving life right now. And I'm gonna have a yummy steak salad. <laughs> absolutely typical. So we just finished lunch and managed to eat even though Mia was awake the entire time and everyone took a little turn of cuddling her and walking her and singing to her and I tried to feed her, tried everything, she wouldn't sleep and now we're in the car, she's fast asleep. I'm just walking up the stairs to come in and I wondered if I would hear Mia cry but no, listen to this. <laughs> ACDC introduction, yeah? Hmm. <laughs> what is going on here? <laughs> She's quite happy though. Yay! As <laughs> Ingemar uh, looked after Mia for a little bit so I could run out and do some errands. And I've just come home to Mia being dressed up by her father. A little footballer. <laughs> yeah, I'm not sure that she knows exactly what she's wearing. Hey little girly. Yes, are you gonna have to now watch a game with your daddy? I think you are. He says it's important. I know, I object too. Yeah. Can you see yourself, Mrs? Can you see yourself? Do you recognize yourself? That's Mia. <gasps> Yay! <gasps> <laughs> 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 